Alright guys, this is just another wee video. Uh, it's something that I've seen on a few of the groups and it was a question actually somebody asked me a while ago and it was how to make a wee bit extra money from events. So I've had this actually for a few months uh, and it's actually not too bad. It's What it is, it's, it's a wee Polaroid, so I think it's a Polaroid Pogo printer and it attaches to the camera, it uses picked bridge and basically you get, you basically insert uh, the cartridges takes 10 images, I'll just come in a wee bit closer so you can see that so 10 images, let's just get that a wee bit better so that's the Pogo printer there, 10 images it fits in your pocket, it is tiny and basically from one battery charge you can print about 25 images now what you'll find is if you're doing birthday parties kids parties, events these are perfect uh, you could easily, if you've got a spare, get another battery for it and you're looking at you can maybe increase your your revenue at these events by 50 or 100 pounds depending on how much you charge. I was thinking of just charging a pound but you could charge 150, 2 pound, even 250 uh, depending on where you are. It's great for street photography, like I said, events, kids parties, festivals uh, so check it out and also let's see if I can see if you can see it a t-shirt by Raw to the Bone which is here as well, I don't know if you can see that I'll put the link up uh, I'll put the link up on the screen somewhere uh, but I'll show, basically do a wee test print uh, of the image and let you have a wee look at it so, so this is the image that I've just taken a shot of it's just my Polaroid camera and my wee Canon 8 uh, rangefinder and what I'll do is now I shall show you the image getting printed out. So there you go, that's that's the printer there. Maybe if I do it properly. So that's the printer there. It takes 60 seconds to warm up and print out the image. And that's the image there. Which I think is kind of cool for the fact that it's printed a digital image of a Polaroid and a film camera on a Polaroid print. So you've got kind of three generations of uh, cameras in one image uh, technology wise. And the good thing with these as well is the back, the back actually peels off and you can use it as a sticker. Uh, there's no ink quality wise, the quality is okay. I wouldn't say the quality is fantastic, but you're not offering a fantastic print out. It's a novelty thing, uh, but it works. So that's that's a wee add-on on how to basically progress or maybe uh, just increase your uh, revenue a wee bit. And it's great for street photography. I've used this a few times on street photography, and it fits in your pocket. You take a photograph of somebody, do you like it? Here, let me get a wee photograph for you. Give them the photograph business card. Can't get any better than that. So that's the wee Polaroid camera. So also, like I said, don't forget to check out Martin Bone, Roy the Bone. And also, again, uh, lighting my videos is, let's see if I can get it here. Lighting my videos is these aperture light panels and these are fantastic uh, I'll be doing a review on these so I've got about five reviews to get done uh, that will get done over the course of the next uh, month or two I've got a review on the Canon 50mm 1.4 lens I'll have a review on the Canon 17 to 85 and I'll also have a review on the Sigma 70 to 
200 2.8 i'll also have a review going up on the macro light setup from aperture which is a much better than the, the mickey one that i posted earlier this this is one of the best uh, kind of macro rings that i've ever used and i've used maybe six five or six different types it's definitely the best one the light panels from aperture are just so handy they're dead easy i mean there's no weight to them like i said i mean there's there's, I mean, they're, they're hand sized but they're great for just sticking in the bag if you need any extra lighting. They fit on a tripod, they've got the adapters, and they are so, so good. Also, check out the video. I should have one or two videos on gig and festival photography. So, that's my video on the wee Polaroid. If you've got any questions, please fire them in. Uh, also, if you've got any images that you'd like to uh, for me to showcase on one of my next videos email them in as well I'm going to be doing a couple of different things if you've got an image send them in everybody doesn't matter if you're a beginner advanced send them in and I'll be doing a week in a screenshot slideshow of different images from everybody from around the world so get your images sent in if you get any questions ask but I'll try and give you an answer catch you guys later